Hello. We're gonna see if stream goes a bit better today than it did yesterday. Yesterday was a struggle bus. But I have a new modem and router. Um, however, my frames per second is still all over the place. So I don't know what OBS is doing. Because, like, I just checked my upload speed and download speed or whatever. And it was great. So, like, I don't know. I have no idea. Hi, DB. How are you? You want me to hydrate? Where's my drink water redemption? <laughs> Um, sassy way to get first. Um, I am having an okay day. Uh, went to coffee with my husband and a friend of ours. Um, and then I tried to go to the credit union that we had a car loan through. Because, like, we paid off the car loan back in March and we still haven't received the title. And the branch that we went to is now closed. So now i got to figure out... I think there's one on the way to the coffee shop we like to go to on Wednesdays, so we're just going to try to stop by there on Wednesday. Um, and then I went and looked for clearance paint. Did not find any, but I got my new modem. And then I set that up. <laughs> and that has pretty much been my my whole day. Um, other than that, my only plans for today are to scrapbook, but I have this really... Hello, Philippe. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate you. Um, I have this bad habit. Okay, so my husband takes my my, sec my secondary phone, my old iPhone, and has one of my Pokemon accounts logged into it, and he walks, like, because he walks a lot for work, so then he gets me, like, kilometers on my noob account, like, on my old phone. But guess who needs that old phone when she does create and caffeinate streams so that you guys can look at me and what I'm working on? I do. And guess who always forgets to get that other phone from him when I do these streams? I do. <laughs> so I'm like, well, I'll scrapbook and I'll just show you guys what I'm doing, I guess, <laughs> as I'm working on it because I only have the one camera. Um... But yeah, I don't, I don't know. I just always forget it. But basically I'm working on the scrapbooks from the trip to Greece. Um, so I have my, I, I journal when we travel. So I have my travel journal. Um, so I can write stuff down on the scrapbook pages from the travel journal. Um, cause I'm extra, I guess. I don't know. And then I have extra pictures that didn't make it onto the pages so these will be going in the covers of the scrapbooks i guess so like on the covers of the scrapbooks like on the inside cover i put stuff so extra pictures will make it on here or something i don't know i don't know what i'm gonna do yet hi johnny how are you welcome on in happy saturday um here, am I backwards to you guys? That's what I don't know. Like, if I show this. I don't think the words are backwards. Okay. So this is... I'm just going to show you guys what I have done because there's only, like, a page or two left in this one to do. So we're just going to have, like, a flip book moment here where just, like, pretend you're in elementary school and I'm, like, the librarian showing you a book or something. I don't know. Okay. Can I lower this to make it easier on myself? Let's see. Ugh. You just stapled your thumb. Well, you're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to staple paper. Um. So when I went to Greece first and then my husband joined me a few days later and I got put in this hotel that was across from this like abandoned fashion warehouse because like the brand on it was an old fashioned brand, but the building was empty. So these are pictures of the empty building. You did that in elementary school? Well, you should have learned then, DB. You should have learned. <laughs> um, I wanted to go into this building so badly, but then, like, one of the times I went outside, somebody was smashing the windows from the inside and the glass was, like, falling down to the sidewalk, and I'm like, maybe I shouldn't do that. Maybe I should not go in there. Yeah, so there's a pigeon. 
that's on the abandoned building. Um, more abandoned building. And then I went for a walk, and here are more buildings. Sorry, they're like in shiny sleeves, so it's kind of reflective. So I'm trying to like angle it for you guys. I do not mind at all, DB. You play your battlefield. I appreciate the lurk. Um, it's weird trying to go like opposite directions. Then like I took pictures of some graffiti. Like there is no more love, only lust. And then it's signed by these two people. They wrote like all sorts of graffiti over there and one was like stand here for a free blowjob and I'm like how will they know to show up <laughs> like that was like my first thought I'm like how will they how will they know to show up um and then my husband joined me in Greece and we got euros because of course we did you love lust oh my gosh then you have like the best of both worlds maybe um, just an old dude. Okay, so then I moved our stuff into this apartment. Like, the door's right there. I guess just an old dude walking up the sidewalk. I did edit all of these pictures, or most of these pictures, on stream. So they probably look familiar to you guys if you're hanging out at that time. Um, then I went to some old place. You can't really see it, but in the top picture there's a cat on that arch. Uh, I don't know. It's so reflective. It's so reflective. Um. There's a lot of stray cats in Greece. And I take pictures of a lot of the cats. Um. But yeah. Oh my god, we're so cute. Oh. Um, this tree on the bottom. This tree. I called the pigeon tree. Because, like, we would go to this park and all the pigeons would just gather in this tree together. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, but here's a dude feeding the pigeons. And then a lamppost. And then a birds of paradise. So now, okay, so these pictures eh, are on the island of Crete. Um, other way. So bird of paradise. And then the Bay of Satia on the island of Crete. They call it Crete, which is why I wrote it that way. Oh my god. Seagulls. I just like taking pictures of animals, okay? Even if it's squirrels. Or seagulls. I don't know. The seagulls. And then a boat. Oh yeah, a boat. A boat on the bay. Um, I took this picture specifically. Uh, I haven't sent it to him yet. But I took this picture of this giant cactus specifically to show to raise a fan. Because, like, I don't know a lot about cacti. But he lives in Arizona, so there's a lot of cacti where he lives. And I was like, I didn't know they got this big. So I got it. I took, I literally took this to show to him. And I don't think I have sent it to him yet because I'm a bad noodle. Um, abandoned Barbie boot because, you know. Which way am I going? This way. And then just some old ass buildings on the water. Um, more, more birds. Don't judge me. We have some geese. A cat with a barrel or a bucket and then a duck. This duck on the bottom, my husband tried to, like, get really close to. I don't know if he was trying to pet it or just see how close it would let him get. He, he got really close and then it flew away. Um, more Satya photos. My adorable hubby. He's so cute. Um, a dog. And just, just, just more Satya stuff. This is what I do, like, all of these albums back here on the bottom two shelves are scrapbooks I have completed. Hold on. These two books are books that are completed. These are all empty, waiting to be made into books. Some of them are Peter Rabbit ones, so those will be for my kiddo when she's born this summer. Um, and other ones are just, like, 
or whatever, I guess. I don't know. But I took a lot of pictures of doors and windows. And a bicycle and a window. And then the piano stairs. Which I think it cleaned up before, like, their big tourist season. I don't know. Because it was quite messy when we were there. But we were there in February. You lost. Well, you better try, try again. <laughs> um. Oh, I did look up the name of this town. Did I write it down? I, I labeled this photo file on my hard drive. The name of this town, but... And then the windmill, the windmill, the windmill of the priest. Respawn! Yeah, exactly. Um, some flowers and an olive orchard because Greece. <laughs> See what I have to resort to when I forget my other phone? Um, and then some more on the island of Crete. Here's the moo cat that I really wanted to bring home. But my husband told me no. And I know, it would have been really hard to bring a cat home from the island of Crete and Greece. But it was a very friendly moo cat. Alright, then we got sheep that we saw on the side of the road. A church. Did I put the church name? No. I just thought it was not a church by the sea, but I did label it on my photo file. Rainbow! Um... In case you guys didn't know, the end of the rainbow is in the Aegean Sea. So you're gonna need, like, a scuba suit or something to go get the pot of gold, okay? I was right there, but I was ill-prepared to get the pot of gold. Um, so this is still on the island of Crete. But Satia, which is, like, what a lot of the other pictures are from, or, like, in between, um, the capital and Satia, is on the eastern side of the island. Now we're going to Shania, which is on the western side of the island. So this was taken on the way there. There's a little kitty cat in the... Let me see if I can... Reflection. There's a kitty cat in the grass there. Um, and then more more olive trees. I know. Shh. Shocking. Um, this is Shania. Photos of Shania. It's really pretty, by the way. Um, very touristy, so I'm glad we were there in February. Um, these pictures are of a wall that was, like, destroyed in World War II, so it's like a World War II memorial. But a little kitty cat lives there. Um, and then... This is where I stopped. See? I haven't done this, this page yet. So, that's what I'm gonna be working on. Well, we're all just chilling and hanging out, and you guys are enjoying your coffee, and I don't have any because I finished my coffee. Ugh. But I hope everyone is having a good weekend. Ooh, lots of ribbons in this one. Okay, so this is like what I do. So, like, I throw everything that I want on the page in the photo pocket together, like the page pocket. And then I just assemble it. So it makes it, instead of it being a long process for every single page, to like figure out what paper I want to use, what stickers I want to use, what like ribbons or other little pretty things I want to use on each page, I just um, put it all together beforehand. So yeah, that does take a while, but then when it comes to assembly time, it goes by pretty quickly. And I typically just mirror the other side with main things. So say we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this ribbon first, which kind of looks like a garter to me, but I had it, so we're using it. Okay. Don't judge me. So I'm just tipping it to the page. So basically, I usually wrap the ribbon around the edge of the paper and tape it on the back. It's just easier for me, I guess. I don't know. And then you don't see the tape. Because oh, it's on the back. 
The thing you have to be careful about is because paper is not, like, you know, stiff. You can, like, bend the paper and then tape it, and then, like, it'll be, like, in the book. Not that I think many of you need scrapbooking tips. I'm probably, like, the last person on Earth scrapbooking. That might be an exaggeration. But maybe not. <laughs> I got a lot of my scrapbooking stuff from, um, from my sister-in-law's grandma. I'm just looking at the other page, making sure I'm mirroring it correctly. Okay. I have a lot of these little mounting squares. I never really use them. I never really buy them, but I have a lot from my adopted grandma. I usually just use scotch tape. A lot of scrapbookers will be like, no, don't do that. But honestly, like, I have done so many books and the scotch tape holds up just fine. I'm only using the mounting squares because I have them and I want to get them off my desk. Hi, poultry. You used to use those mounting squares to illegally stick up photos in museums. <laughs> you know, I don't know if you're being serious or not, but I would not doubt you. I would not doubt you. How are you today? Just like, go into a museum and hang up one of your own photos. Also, whenever I scrapbook, I just put everything in a paper bag because it's all paper scraps and then this just goes in paper recycling when I'm done. You're okay? You were gonna go do Taylor Swift stuff but you're sick? You were gonna go to a Swift concert? I saw the photo of um of her with Prince William, Prince George, and Princess Charlotte. I thought that was kind of cute. I was like, oh, look at them little Swifties. It's kind of close to you. Well, I'm sorry that you're sick. I hope you, uh, get better soon. I'm just taping another ribbon. Don't mind me. I really need some damn diffuser for that window. What? You don't you don't like the um the bright ass rectangle over there? <laughs> Honestly, I thought about um cuz I really only have a blackout cellular shade for it, so if I close it, then like it's going to be really really dark in here. But I thought about getting like a decal for the window. This is like, hi neighbors, or something for like the house behind me. I don't know. <laughs> hi, Bob. How are you? Hello, Victacular. Just dropping in to say hi. Unfortunately, cannot stay. Although, if you're still alive later, I should be able to drop back in. How's Lassie doing? I'm doing all right. Thank you. I appreciate the stop in. Um, I hope you're doing well. Just blow up the sun. I mean, like, I don't have the power to do that, but like, if you want to. Go for it. Oh, I taped it on the wrong side. Well done. This is literally all I have done so far, is tape one ribbon and one piece of paper, but then I taped this ribbon on the wrong corner because I'm special. You got a Home Depot? I do. I hate the Home Depot, though, that we have here. But I'll go to Lowe's, go buy some white foam core, and slap that in the window. The white will reflect and bounce light back into my room. You you hatin'? 
You hating on the sunshine, Chris? Honestly, it's usually, usually not really a problem because I stream, like, literally all of my other streams are in the evening. But yeah, these Saturday streams, it's, it's right there. It's right there. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I am. I'm hating on the sunshine. Instead of uh, Katrina and the waves or whatever, the walking on sunshine, you're singing like, I'm hating on sunshine. Uh, Bob says, glad to hear that lassie blue little lamb. Sorry for the quick drop in and out. At least you'll have some peace until I return to commit ungodly amounts of brain rot. I look forward to it, Bob. I 100% look forward to it. So these are the pictures going on this page. We have one of sailboats in the Chanya Harbor. Um, and then one of the Chanya Lighthouse. Exactly. <laughs> now I'm, I'm trying to think. I'm like, I have softbox stuff, but I don't think that's big enough for the window. Like to just like kind of stick up in there. I'll just hang a sheet up. You know, Chris, if you had if you had been a witness to my streams before I was part of the photo fam. So this desk here, my computer desk used to be that desk. So I would like sit right in front of the sun. You would have loved it. I would have been your favorite streamer of all time. Because my face was so overexposed because <laughs> I also just used to use my um my built-in mic and built-in camera on my computer I mean you would have been just so impressed with my skills you would have been like this the streamer she's gonna be big one day <laughs> I would have committed home invasion. And fa okay, I'll move my computer back then so that you have to come invade my home. Is that the trick to getting you to getting you to come here? I'll do it. Don't doubt me. Okay, all I really have left to do on this page is add this oval and this little Discover sticker. I keep trying to get people to visit me and everybody's like, no. I'm like, fine. I'm like, whatever. They don't want you to visit anyway. That's funny though. I would have committed committed home invasion. Am I going to TwitchCon? New no. No, I am not. Are you? I don't like a lot of people, poultry. <laughs> so, like, I have a hard time convincing myself that I want to go to, like, this big event where a lot of people are. <laughs> I'm like, eh. Doesn't sound that appealing. Okay, so I have this little discover. Uh huh. Wrong directions. Discover with like the little hole in the tag. So I have this little, little tiny. I don't know why my nail looks dirty. It's not dirty. 
Um, with this little tiny pin thing to go through that hole. Neither do I, but there's always free food. I mean, free food, right? Because you paid for the ticket. To cover the food expenses. You're going to the one in the United States? Because there's like a European one and then the one in the USA, right? I think. Alright, I gotta write something on this page. I used a pink marker. You like my mug? Did I just pull cat hair out of it? That's nice. Um, but it says, stop, smile, breathe. Life is beautiful. My niece got it for me. Oh, I make sure I take enough of the free drinks and food so it amounts to more than the ticket costs. Just out of principle. Bet. Only the US one? The, U one is, the EU one is trash? Really? I mean, I wouldn't know. I'm just kind of surprised, I guess. Okay, what do I want to write on this page? Oh, sorry, that was probably long. We're just going to write... Ooh, this marker is dying. The... Shania... Lighthouse stands boldly guiding ships into the port. And that marker is trash. Ta-da. That page is done. Um, a Futtic Photon goes to the, uh, the TwitchCon poultry if you wanted to connect with them. Why they go though, and they they know they know that I feel this way, so I don't feel shy about saying it. Why they want to go though, I don't know because they get depressy every time they go. Why do that to yourself? I have this with a little bird. More ribbon. I used a lot of ribbon in this book. Um, just a little corner decal. A frame. And the photo. More doors and windows. I'm telling you, I have a problem. Somebody needs to um, have an intervention about my obsession with doors and windows. Please and thank you. TwitchCon is way more fun if you don't stream at it. Are you going to be streaming at it, or are you just kind of taking it off to enjoy it? Hell no, I'm taking a holiday and taking photos. Good for you. Good for you. You take the damn holiday, you eat all the food, you drink all the drinks, you take your photos. You have a good time. You're gonna eat so much food, probably gonna steal some street signs. <laughs> Like, like, legit, like, the, uh, the street signs that the city, like, puts up? Or, like, are there, like, or do you mean, like, the A-frame signs for, like, the event? Um, you want to punch a shark? I don't think there's going to be sharks there, poultry. 
Unless you mean, like, a business shark. A loan shark. Then punch them all you want. Thank you for the water, Rumpel. Also, hi, Rumpel. How are you, Rumpel? You can't see it, but I'm crafting down here. But I'm showing stuff on, showing stuff on, showing stuff off as I work on stuff. You're high? Good for you. Did you, um, nope, that one's done. Did you use that stuff in the can that you were, um, showing me last night on the Discord? You're not high yet or you haven't used that stuff yet? Sorry. No. You've been boxing? Excuse me. Rumple? Voluntarily? I just have to ask. Boxing. Oh, boxing to move. Not like boxing. I'm moving next week and wait because I, I went with the wrong boxing. I'm sorry, Rumble. I was like, wait a minute. Like, don't get me wrong. I think you could kick some ass, but I also feel like, and I could be wrong, I also feel like you're not the kind of person to just, like, voluntarily get in a boxing match. But yes, you mean, like, moving boxes. You're boxing stuff to move. Got it. Wait, where do I want this frame? But I was kind of concerned for, like, uno momento. Their frame is on. I think I'm gonna put the bird... <laughs> there, without it falling over, because it will be taped. Well, actually, do I have more squares? First box of books that had all my Tolkien. What Tolkien books do you have? Out of curiosity. Uh, like all of them. I have a first American edition of the Silmarillion. Not as cool as, like, the first edition, but, like, I'll take what I can get. You wish you, you could find all of them? Like, all of the ones that you own? Are some missing? Some Lorillian, Beowulf, Unfinished Tales. Obviously The Hobbit and Lord of the Rings. I'm cutting apart the s mounting squares to fit on these thin stems of this, this thing.
Is it terrible that, like, I'm like, I'm gonna read the Silmarillion to my daughter as she's, like, a little kid to put her to sleep? Because I'm like, then she's falling asleep listening to something complicated <laughs> and intelligent. I don't know. That probably won't happen, but I would like to think it will. Oh, I didn't take that one off. Let's see. There you go. Now it's all taped on there. Read the hot. I know. I know you're supposed to read The Hobbit first and, and then Lord of the Rings and then go into the more complex writings, I guess, but you read a book once? I was crazy once. Hmm. What color do I want to use? It kind of goes with that green. Sure. Then is there anything that I want to specifically write about from Shonya? Okay, this is on the way to Siftia. Here's Shonya. No. Nothing specific about this building. Rebecca took a lot of photos of doors and windows in Greece including this photo of the entrance to a restaurant I still have the ribbon. I forgot about the ribbon. That needs to go in here somewhere. Mm. Uh. I think I'll just put it right on this edge. Ooh. Actually. So instead of just putting it on this edge, I'm going to put it behind the triangle. But I'm going to tape the top end first. This is such a naughty song that it used to play in JCPenney and that really cracks me up. Because I don't think anybody in the company listened to the actual lyrics of the song before they were like, yeah, let's do our store playlist. I think they were just like, this is a popular song and we need to play it to keep the kids coming in our store and not just have boomers shopping at our store. <gasps> Almost to the end of this tape roll. Oh, no. Here are my squares. Well, Twitch hasn't yelled at me at all today, so maybe uh, streams a little better than yesterday. Yesterday was a shit show. But I did put the photo that I edited on stream in the PhotoFam Discord. There. 
Now to do the opposite page. Hi, Myrtle. Hi from Myrtle and Myrtle's boyfriend. Hello. How are we doing this Saturday? Peachy Boy says, hey, hi, Peachy Boy. I like that, Peachy Boy. His name is Jeff. No shit. That's my dad's name. What are you guys up to today? And one of my cousin's names, actually. Okay, I'm gonna do the ribbon first this time. And then put the triangle over it. <laughs> Jeffa? Dunham. Dunham. I'm assuming that's what you were going for. He literally has a peach tree in his front yard, too. It's so suitable. Oh. Peachy boy it is. It's his dad's name, too. <gasps> Are we secretly related? That'd be funny. I was actually legitimately in a stream chat one day, and, like, three of us in the chat discovered that we all have cousins in, um, part of North Dakota, and we were like, Are we related? Because, like, there's there's not a lot of uh, people in North Dakota. Is it a junior? T -t 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 Today, junior. Let's see here. Where did I... Just needs to be in this bottom corner. Yes. I don't think there are any juniors in my family. Juniors had their moms moaning in bed before they were born, just saying. <laughs> Rumble. You're still thinking about that dungeon? Um, Rumpel, I don't know if you heard it or if you were gone by that time, but I had said something about Rumpel's biddies on stream yesterday, and I was like, I should not say that. That sounds naughty. And, uh, then somebody said, what if we changed it to Rumpled biddies? And I'm like, you no. <laughs> no, no Rumpled biddies. No. Okay, so I have three pictures to go on this page, but I'm only going to use two. This one, and this one, and this one will just go in the extra pictures. Oh, there. Hi, Max. How are you? Happy Saturday. It's almost time for you to stream. Epic failure with these teams today? DB. You're supposed to be kicking ass and taking names, DB. No, my videos are hairy. <laughs> when gaming is hard. Ugh. You better switch to something peaceful like Animal Crossing. You're good, Max? Glad to hear it. I'm doing well. Thank you. It is, and I'm going to hang out here till then. <laughs> Sounds good. Um, what is on the agenda for today, Max? You 
You're kicking ass, Stevie, but your team not so- Windmaker? <gasps> I love Windmaker. Okay. How far into Wind Waker are you? Because when Goonie V played Wind Waker, I played along with them. And it was actually kind of fun. <laughs> you did the first dungeon? I'll never catch up to you. You're so fast! You're so fast! But no, like, we had a spreadsheet of, like, the map that we made to, like, notate where certain treasures and stuff were. So, like, we would help each other, like, build the Wind Waker map. And the spreadsheet. I literally, um, my Wii U is the Zelda-themed Wii U because it, like, came with Wind Waker. That was the whole reason I got a Wii U. <laughs> Yeah, it was fun. If she's saying you're fast, you get... Yeah. Yep, you gotta let her finish first. It's true. Oh, that's incredible. I bet it looks amazing. It's cool. It's pretty cool. I mean, Rumpel's not wrong. I'm doing all right, Mix. I'm doing all right. Warlock's at work. So I'm just home with all of the pets. Doing a little bit of scrapbooking. And then I don't know what I'm going to do after this. Like, I'll be, like, in stream chats and stuff. But I might play Minecraft. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. They all deserve treats. I'm guessing the golden retriever's in the front room. And the cat, too. Yeah, it's really hot again here today, so they won't get a lot of outside time because they have zero self-control to, like, know when to come in when it's too hot. Like, I'll literally look outside if I leave them out there, and they'll just, like, be on... The pavers back there, like, <laughs> like, dying, and I'm like, dude, come inside. What are you doing? Why are you trying to die? This is not allowed. Exactly. Like, I'm like, you can cut, like, they literally have a doggy door. They don't have to choose this way. I don't know, man. Okay. So this is what I have so far. And I just have little bird stickers to put on now. Because why not? We like birds. Thanks, Max. It was a good run, Mom. I shall see you in the afterlife. No! I'm telling you, they're not allowed to die. It's it's not allowed. Okay, what is this building called? I gotta look in my journal. The Arsenali Veneziani. Okay. Which apparently means Venetian shipyards. My playlist is always 10 out of 10. This is my Wiggle Time playlist. So when my nephew, who's now two, um, when he was a baby, and I would watch him, I would play certain songs, and like whatever ones he started like wiggle dancing to, I would like play on repeat. So this this playlist is inspired by by him. 
Because, like, it just makes you want to be like... And wiggle. <laughs> Rebecca! And Warlock. Walked down to the Arsenali Veneziani and then in parentheses. Venetian shipyards. And then, because these scrapbooking things don't like Sharpie and like to smear, I cover it with scotch tape. Exactly. Wiggle time. Just like that. How is Eileen doing, Max? She holding up with summer break? Being busy per usual. Any other uh, big trips in her future? Last year she went to uh, Disney. Wasn't sure if she had something big planned for this summer. You don't think so? There you go. That page is done. There's only one page left to do in this book. And then it'll be time for book number two. I'm making the uh, the scrapbook for the trip to Greece this last February. Um, ooh, the stickers went flying. Arnar, Arnar. There we go. So this book is almost done. I just have this last page to do. And then there's a whole other second book that I need to do for the trip because it didn't fit in one book. Yeah. Yep. So these bottom two shelves are scrapbooks that are done. Um, it's always weird pointing on this. Hold on. <laughs> These two books are also done. These ones are all empty um, and will eventually be completed books. Some of the empty ones are Peter Rabbit themed, so those will be for the legend after she's born. Um, and then other ones are just extra books that I have. But when I have um, like this Grease trip that takes two albums, I like the albums to match so you know that they go together, which is why there's a lot of pairs. So, like, these two go together, these two go together, these two go together. I take a lot of pictures. <laughs> so this is the, the base paper for this one, and I'm just taping this one on the background. It's just, like, old letters and stamps kind of thing. Hmm. Oh, but I gotta replace my scotch tape. I only have one. One roll left. Not that it's hard to go get more. Voila. Books for days. I've actually made a spreadsheet of the scrapbooks I have made because I've made so many. Um, and then, so, okay, so I have a spreadsheet of collectibles. If you're interested in looking at it, Max, I'll send it to you. 
but it has like our Nintendo 64 games on there that we own, um, DS games, NES games, and then like there's a tab for our books, a tab for the scrapbooks, um, all sorts of things. I should add a tab for our board games. Sure. Okay. I will send it to you. And then I expect you to look at it in the first 30 seconds of sending it to you. I'm just kidding. Or am I? I shall. I'm going to send it to you after you start stream. And then I'm going to be like, why haven't you looked at it yet? Why haven't you looked at it yet, Max? Why? Are you busy? Just give you a hard time. I once, um... There's a photo streamer named Stephen F. Photography here on Twitch. And he once was like, you guys can message me about anything on Instagram. So I would message him like the most random things like do you think hippopotamus are cute oof unfolding all the shirts to wash them to pack them is a pain in the ass you could always wash them after you move oh. all right let's see if doing shout outs destroys my stream let's hope not Apparently I have to move this way. Okay, I'm gonna pause the music so I can hear this. Ad break has you. Oh no. Rumple. Apparently my dual monitoring thing turned off. Okay, here we go. You're back already? That was really fast. Oh no, is it not gonna play the thing? Or do you? Yeah, he has clips. Hold on. <gasps> it was off. Yes! Oh no. Is this what he's playing right now? Is that Battlefield? I have no idea. Um. All right, so Frosty Tool says, DB Thump is the ultimate creative maestro, juggling photo magic in Lightroom, epic drum solos, and gaming galore in, Battlef in Battlefield 2042. Uh, from live photo shoots to jam sessions, it'll have you grooving. They're a one-stop shop for all things artsy and high octane. Whether it's tweaking pixels of sm or smashing the battlefield, DB Thump stream is where the magic happens. <laughs> Washing them after the move just adds more work. That's fair. I mean, it's it's the same amount of work, isn't it? After or before. Uh, most shooters look the same, right? That could be Halo. That could be Halo for all I know. Um, but guys, that is DB Thump. I know DB Thump from the Photo Family, but he does some gaming streams, as you just saw. Um, he does some IRL streams. I I was actually in one of his IRL streams where he went and photographed um, a condo. And it was really cute because like he had the camera on the counter and he was just like, had his head resting on the counter and was like talking to chat and I was like, this is adorable. Um, please, please give him a follow. Yes, Halo. Absolutely. You're sending love from the Ren Fair. Hi, Beck. Enjoy the Ren Fair. I hope you're having all the fun. I hope it's not too terribly hot down there. It's pretty hot up here. Um, but enjoy the Ren Fair. I'm sure you look fantabulous. Is there a picture of your costume anywhere? Of your Ren Fair outfit? You did? Okay, I'll have to go look. I'm assuming in the uh, in the Discord. I'm not doing ads, that's why it's not coming up with anything. I'm like, what is happening? L M. Pew, pew. 
Oh, yeah, I killed it, but I died. Just, just phase. Yeah, we did it. We did it. Oh, we fucking did it again. We did it again. <laughs> we did it again. I like your little like excited fingers at the end there. Was that Halo, Max? Max, was that Halo? I mean, like you were shooting stuff, so it's got to be Halo. Um, guys, that is Master Max 165. He will be starting stream here in approximately 22 minutes. Um, <laughs> and is working on getting through Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Are you doing the three heart? You're doing the three heart challenge with Wind Waker too, right? Um, that was not Halo. Yes, it was, Rumpel. Yes, it was. Every shooter game is Halo. Um, <laughs> yes, okay. I thought so because... So Max just completed a three heart challenge with Ocarina of Time. I'm pretty sure he had zero deaths with that one. He had three deaths with three heart challenge of Majora's Mask. Um, and now he's on to Wind Waker. Have you died yet with Wind Waker, Max? <laughs> um, but yeah, so please please follow Max. He he gets through the games so fast, man. He's just a pro, 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 pro. Nope, but I was close. Oof da. Oof da, Max. Oof da. Good shout out to Myrtle. Another Halo game. Oh my god, there's so many. Bitch, get bugged. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, snap. Apex, I mean, uh, Halo. Except Halo. Everything is Halo. Um, guys, that is OK Go Myrtle. Myrtle typically streams in the middle of the day. Um, so they're an excellent, you know, if you need a daytime streamer to fill your void of time in the middle of the day, please follow Myrtle. And I'm talking US hours. Um, Myrtle does play Apex Legends and some Fortnite. I was watching Myrtle play Fortnite the other day. Um, there was a lot of drum playing in Fortnite. I was not expecting that. I've never really seen Fortnite being played. Um, all I've seen are, like, there's this video going around on social media of, like, these two people dancing with each other in Fortnite. I didn't know you could play drums, too. So, like, I don't know. It was interesting to me. But please follow Myrtle. Here we go. So, this is the before. Before he was a ghost. Where we started. And before he was Skelly Boy. And this is the after. It's one continuous shot? That's fuck. If you follow Photo Elite, Go to his profile page, and I believe in his about me. He has like what his new Twitch pages. Let me make sure because he's moving his Twitch stuff to a new profile. So let me just look. Oh, <gasps> you don't. <gasps> well, all right. Well, follow him anyway, and then we'll get you moved over to his new profile. Profile once he starts using that. Um, but I call Photo Elite the, the Photoshop unicorn. Um, I would shout out his new account. I just never remember if there's underscores or not. But it's like Pixel pi Pickle. Pixel Pickle. Um, but seriously, like, he's very, very talented. Very skilled. Um, please follow him. We got poultry motion. We got a lot of people stopping in today. <laughs> We're live on Twitch right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, I'm like a fashion week photographer, but I, I live stream on Twitch as well. Yeah, so I'm an IRL streamer. What, you have a camera and the light on it? Yeah, because I'm, I'm a, I'm a, 
street photographer who does like portraits of strangers. So yeah, and then when I seen you were here, I was like, damn, I'm doing fashion week. I need to get a photo. Uh, my name's Chicken. But it's like, yeah, I, I love can, Chicken. Nice to meet you. I can show you that. Um, I've, I've taken photos of quite a few streamers at this point, so you might recognise some of the people in. My name's Chicken. <laughs> um, that is poultry motion. I guess I guess he's telling people his name is Chicken. Might as well believe him. Um, but he is an IRL streamer. He often does IRL streams of like the streets of London, but sometimes he takes us back like to a nice creek and stuff and watches the sunrise. It's really chill over there. Um, please give them a follow. You're back to the fair toodles, friends. Have fun, bun bun bag. Get a cool, get a cool wand or hat or something too. <laughs> At least that's that's what I would do. But that that I have a wand from the Ren Fair. Actually, it's back like, there. Like the yeah, like yeah. Shutter, shutter down. Is, yeah. Yeah. His, his name is Shutter Down Photography. Okay. Uh, I I thought down. it was like Chowder. <laughs> <laughs> That that you it would be from Massachusetts or Maine. It would be he just shouting. all all he does is just go around to other photographers and say, "Shut her down! Shut her down! Get out of here! No more photos here." Okay, I think I need to. Uh... Thank you for laughing at that. That is Rumpel still come. Um, who will be doing more streams once he's in his new place? He moves next Saturday. Um, and I have a goal to get him more clips because it always plays the same clip. So I think he's only got one. Um, but he photographs uh, bands. He does a lot of concert photography. But that was actually like a, a session with a band to do like their portraits. Um, Maple just taking over streams. I know. I know, right? I do think it's funny though. Like sometimes when we like raid another photographer and like we're both in the same chat. And he's like, yeah, I directed Becca to, like, right over here or whatever. This has happened, like, a couple of times. They'll do a shout-out for Maple and I. And Maple's shout-out usually ends up being one about, like, me. And I'm like, that's funny. I wonder if, like, Twitch knows. <laughs> like, we raided over here together. I don't know. Um, but, yeah. That is that is Rumpelstiltcam. Please follow him. He is very, very skilled in the concert photography and band portraits. I don't know if there's a more technical term for that um, realm. But also does some cosplay photography, also does some gaming. Please give him a follow. And he does funny voices on his microphone. And if you put hello, I don't even know if my sounds are working today, to be honest. Uh, but if you do hello, he will always follow it up with General Kenobi. If you do the hello from... You know, Obi Wan. That might be everybody, but let me just check out. Oh, sorry, Max. It won't work in here. I got you. Got to wait a minute. Hold on. <laughs> sorry. Here I am setting you up, and then I'm like, oh, actually, it doesn't work in this scene. Um. Try it now. So I don't know if it will. Hold on. Properties. Let's reset you. Sometimes I have to like reconnect the bot. Like, it's supposed to work. Unless it's just not connecting. I don't know. Firebot is weird sometimes. You, you get, to get it to a stream that has it. It does. It's supposed to. It's supposed to have the chat triggers. And it, Firebot even says it's connected, so I don't know. Here, let me go into hello. It's just supposed to be hello. Edit. Can I? How do I test it? Because it does this a lot, like where it just like won't work or like it'll like be super delayed. And you guys will hear it like 10 minutes after you type it. 
I just... I've clicked, like, on hello, like, three times, so, like... I have no idea. Let me just make sure the file path is... <gasps> Maybe the file path got broken because I changed my modem so the connection might not be there. Hold on. I bet that's what it is. One second. I don't think my external hard drive is connected to this computer right now because I changed the modem, which changed the Wi-Fi, which changed the connection between my computers. I didn't think of that until right meow. So hold on. New modem shenanigans. Okay. Hopefully this is gonna work now, maybe? It's connecting. And now it's loading. Let me reconnect it to Firebot just to be sure. Firebot. Hello there. Aha! It should you should have heard that. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Unless that's just on my end when I test. I'm not really sure. Victory not within my grasp. Curse this game, Berserker Rage! <laughs> You hear it now? Cool. Hello! There you go. I forgot about that. I forgot about how, like, it has to connect to my external hard drive over on the other computer. And that, that it all gets messed up when network stuff happens. The so, oops. My bad. But it's working now. I think my Wiggle Time playlist ran out because this is like some random songs that it's playing right now. Might have just heard me peel that off of the plastic. This is what it looks like so far. <laughs> but yeah, now that we have all new Wi-Fi stuff, I'm like, uh, when I go downstairs and I want to game, I'm gonna have to, like, connect all the gaming systems to the new Wi-Fi. So I, all I wanted was a new modem, um, because our modem was pretty old, but then, like, the internet provider we have only does modems and routers. Like, it's an all-in-one thing. So we have a new router, too, since it's all-in-one. All-in-one machine. I'm putting little arrow stickers on now. But I'm glad I was able to figure that out. I'm like, why isn't this working? Why is another thing broken in my stream? They're unstable. Arr, no. Stabilize yourself, OBS. Well, hopefully it's not too choppy. Stream, come back. You can blame it all on OBS. Because, like, it shows it's fine again in OBS, so I'm waiting for it to, like, be okay on the Twitch side.
It's gonna be nice to get a new place with faster internet. I have faster internet, so I don't know why it's doing it. Like, my download is 246 megabytes per second. Like, I know it's not, like, the super duper fastest out there, but, like, and then 54.5 upload. So, like, I don't think it's my internet. I think it's something else dumb going on with OBS. I'm really- so I noticed a lot of stupid things happening with my new computer. And I am so tempted to factory reset it, but then I have to reset up OBS. I have all of my scenes saved in a folder. And I know somebody- maybe it was you, Rumble. Once mentioned how to back up OBS, but I have to look that up because I don't remember. You got to go. Have fun with stream, Max. <laughs> I hope you have a good day. I'll be in stream in a bit. Um, I need paper. Because I did not put writing paper in here. I don't even know what this is. I don't really care. We're using fun scissors. Yeah, it still says unstable. I don't know why. But I'm still on the OBS side. Okay. He's back. This paper, I have a whole bin of like those wrap pieces that'll go in there. Why do you still stay un? Why do you still stay unstable? It's heckin' rude. Alright, let's write on this last page of the first book. After leaving Shania, Rebecca, and Warlock, drove back to the hotel where they tried to get some sleep before. They're one o'clock a.m. Ferry. Ride to Santorini. That's where we went next. I was like, where do we go next? Santorini. Hmm. At least my dropped frames aren't climbing. When I ended stream yesterday, I literally took a video of it because like, the dropped frames were just like, and I don't know why. Very right to San Fran. They barely got any sleep before it was time to leave the island of Crete in parentheses Crete. There we go. Book number one is Hi, Lich. How are you? Welcome in. Oh, sorry. Here's what it looks like. And if you pause the film or whatever, the stream, and you zoom in, you'll see Warlock's real name. But it's really a secret, but it's kind of a secret, but not really a secret. It's like basically everybody knows it. And an envelope on the cover. Two extra reasons. That's that. So don't fall. Last two for six days off. Nice. And there goes my frames per second. Hold on. Let's see. I'm gonna turn off these.
there we go. Now we're climbing back up a little. I'm human now. Well, that's good. Well, I'm going to quit Discord. I was going to make sure, I feel like there was another page that I needed to write stuff on, but didn't, because I didn't have paper for it, so I'm just double-checking. This book, before I move on to a new book, um, did that, wrote on that one, that's fine. This one, the bicycle one. Oh. A lot of these papers have like patterns on them, so they're not good like writing on papers. I could just do white. Hold on. I'm going to get my um Throwing my voice? What do you mean? <laughs> no, that would... That would be... Twitch. I wish I had such skills. Okay.
Glitch 1337 just shared one bits. Let's do this one. <laughs> Lidge. Thank you, Lidge, for the bitty. Otherwise, I'm thinking once I finish making sure this book is complete, I'm just going to call it and like try to do some OBS work in the background. Off stream. Because I don't know why it's just taking a shit on me. Okay. Need a marker. Door plus window plus cool things. Yep, that's what I'm writing because I don't know what else to write on this page. Just want to say hi. Still at work. Make sure sucks. I'm sorry, Lidge. I appreciate you popping in. And I hope you have a great rest of your shift. Just in case this isn't... Like, it says excellent now, but just in case. Thank you for coming in. Have a great rest of shift. And thank you again for the bitty. Let's see here. The piano steps in Satya are a you alert sight. I don't know why I decided to write with the super thick end of the marker, but I did. Yeah. Oh, this one too. Hmm. This one I only need one. One piece of paper. All right. Let's see. Oh, oh, that's too thin. I think I found a nice dark green paper, but it's very small. Need something bigger. We'll use a blue triangle. Why not? I'll just have to use black marker or something so that it stands out on the blue. And now I'm going to have to look up the name of this town, but that's okay.
Um, black marker. But let me look up the name of this town first. It's in this picture. Because I need to know it. For the scrapbook. <laughs> the impeccable images. Pixie set. That was a fun round. You ran over someone with a plane. Good times. <laughs> DB. I'm glad you're having fun. Uh, what is the name of this town? No. Nope, not that town. That one's on Santorini. Hmm. I know I named it. Where is it? <gasps> is this one that I accidentally threw out? And now I'm going to have to find again? Shit. Oh, where is it? It's not Finikia. It's not Astronomia. Frick. Okay, hold on. I haven't emptied my trash cans that might still be in here. Or not. Oh, man. All right, I got to Google Maps this, which is um going to be kind of hard. All right, let's go to I'm doing this on my other computer, so sorry, I can't share the the screen. Drive.google.com. Oh, not that. Maps. <laughs> I always go to drive because I'm like, I was driving, but I want maps.google.com. And I want... And it's somewhere close to the highway between Satia and Araklion. There's a lot to cover. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, I think it's this. Because I recognize this. Torlotti? Torlotti. Yes! Let's go! The island of... Or not island. The town of Torlotti. Alright, we're just going to put... Top... The town. 
of Torotti Bottom, the windmill of the priest. Uh, voila. DB, I'm glad you're having fun. Okay. This one has writing. That one has writing. This one has writing. This one does not. Goodness gracious me, oh my. I did not do very well at prepping this one. Let's see. Yeah, we're just going to use the one with the, the heart cut out of it. But I'm going to cut it in half and use it on either page. Because I am mean, and I am cruel, and I am evil. Okay. See, so it's going to be like this. And then I'll be like that on the other page. Um, this one I think I have the name of two. Let's see. I named it in Greek though, didn't I? Yeah, it's not one I wanted to add to the website, so I gotta go to the original. Oh, Adventures, Greece. And then Shania, February 18th, 2024, JPEGs. And here it is. Oh gosh, Parathalosios, Archiomos, and then Theseus, that's what that one is. I know how to read Greek. I don't know what any of it means, but I know how to read a good portion of it. <laughs> um... This town we saw from a distant distance is, and we're going to write this in Greek, okay, um, which means that I need to look at it constantly. I can see that I am lagging again in OBS, so we're probably going to have another bad moment on the Twitch side. Soon. Oh, man. Maybe it's a sign. Actually, I need to write this smaller. It's unfortunate. Cannot fit here. So don't mind me as I just put a random block on this page.
All right, I need a thinner marker. But all these are like calligraphy markers that have weird points. You're thin. Okay. Is. Parathal This is. There we go. I'm not used to writing Greek authors, but when I can just copy it from something, that's not so bad. Uh -huh. Alright, then we're going to tape the other half of the heart to this side. And then I think I'm just going to write that this is an olive tree orchard in a random cat. Things? You see a lot of in Greece. Olive orchards. And random cats. Boom. Okay, and the rest have writing. Um so I'm done with book one, and I'm just going to call it here, because OBS is struggling again, and I get really annoyed and frustrated when it struggles, because I don't know how to fix it, except to look at other things um, that I've already fixed within it, and it still is being stupid. So, I'm going to call it here. I don't even think I'm going to read out, because I have, um, <sighs> only a few lurkers, um, which I appreciate you all. But I need to fix OBS before I do anything else. So, love you guys. Next stream is Monday, um, but it won't be a Twitch stream. It'll be a movie night in the Discord. Um, so if you'd like to join the Discord and do a movie night with us, please do. We are going to be watching um, Cool Runnings. Because that's what was voted on yesterday. Um, so between now and the next time that I see you, either here or in another stream chat, don't forget to touch grass and hug trees and stay safe distance from wildlife. Alright, bye guys! The Wombat of Doom just traded with five viewers. Or Wombat will raid. <laughs> Hi Wombat, how are you? I was just ending it. I am so sorry. My OBS keeps breaking. Um, but Wombat, how are you? Um, how was your stream? I know, I know. I'm sorry. I'm Thank sorry. Thank you so much for the raid. Let's give you a shout out. Throw some square poops in the furnace and keep the raid going. Oh my gosh. Hi, Erasmus Razzle Dazzle. How are you? Um, OBS is being fine right now, but it keeps tanking and then, like, it completely destroys my stream, and I don't know what's happening, and I'm getting mad. 
Yeah, I'm sorry, Wabat, but I will I will raid to take the raiders somewhere else. How about that? Um. But yeah, so basically, I got a new modem, new router. Uh, my upload and download speeds are great, so it's not my internet. Um, but OBS keeps um going to like nine frames per second. Or lower, and it just, like, completely destroys everything. Yeah, see? Like, and, I, and I'm honestly, like, I'm legit, like, ready to cry. I am so mad. Um, so that's why I was ending it. But I will raid out to... Um, we'll raid out to Max. He's, he's playing Wind Waker, and he'll take good care of you guys. And... Yeah! So we'll raid out to Max. I'm so sorry, Wombat. Um, you're good. We need a link to the past. GG's on the win! Good for you. Um, that's really awesome. So we'll, we'll take you to another stream. How about that? Um, I'm glad you had a stream. I'm very, very sorry to just be like, I'm handing you off to somebody else, but like, I'm just mad. And I don't handle being mad very well. Um, and I better get offline and figure out if I can fix my OBS. So I'm gonna go try to do that. Um, but we're gonna raid out to Master Max 165 who is playing Wind Waker, so we're just gonna continue the Zelda theme, um, that you had going on. Um, we beat Preacher with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Erasmus, you're like, give credit where credit is due. Thank you. Um, I really, really do appreciate you rating in Wombat, though. CPU throttling. The CPU is at like 15.5% to 18%, which is normally where OBS sits for me. The computer is not hot. Oh, maybe it is on this side. Okay, hold on. You might have something there. I felt it yesterday and it didn't feel hot, but I only felt the one side. So hold on. It is... It is warm on this one side. So maybe that's it. But, like, nothing is there blocking it, so I don't... I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, we be... See, look. It's, it's, it's going unstable. I'm sorry. I'm mad. Hi, Toasty. We are raiding out to Master Max165. Thank you for the water. I drank my water. I promise. Let's when raid. I promise Thank you so much for the raid. Never, Let's give you a ever shout out. Break that promise. Okay. Ever. Bye, guys. I'm sorry. I'm just mad. Okay. Bye. Wombie, I love you. Thank you for the raid.